me? You think this is funny? In a cosmic sort of way, yes. Well, Mr. Funny Man, is this how you get your sick kicks? What? It's just an ordinary crabby. Oh my goodness! Squidward! <laughs> Eva. What up, y'all? It's Devin. I'm back again. I got some news. Sony releases first ever clown controller. Dog shit. Looking like a fucking robo puppy. Weird old shit, man. It trying to be the Xbox controller so bad. You fucked up. You lost again. God damn, next generation ain't even began yet and your controller is already worse! My goodness! Talking about Quantum Error! Exclusive to the PS5! Think again! Not today! You thought! Good night! We got games coming to xCloud, well games... More EA games coming to xCloud! Or are on xCloud now! The Sims 4! Dragon Age Inquisition! And Unravel 2 for Android, the X Cloud. Let's get it. We got um PC games coming to the Xbox. We got um Rust. Rust uh closed beta can be found on the Xbox store. So I'm definitely gonna go check that out. Cause I've heard a lot of good things about Rust. Haven't played it yet. I'm not a big on PC gaming, but I'm gonna go check that out. What else? Uh, Xbox Game Pass releasing, finally, finally releasing in Japan and South Korea on the 14th of this month. So, if you live in Japan or South Korea, Xbox Game Pass is coming your way. It's less than a week away. So, let's get it for that. What else, what else, what else? Four year anniversary of Quantum Break was not too long ago game was fucking awesome still love that game to this day might replay it again hell yeah uh, yesterday season 3 for Call of Duty Modern Warfare released new maps, new guns, new modes a whole lot of new shit can't beat new shit can't beat free updates that's just my opinion, you know what I'm saying Stadia releases um, a free two month memberships for all players. No Chromecast included. You don't need one. You can play straight out the browser. Try Stadia for yourself. See if it's dog shit. See if it's okay. See if it's amazing to you. It's all based on your own opinion. So, yep, you, you gotta sign up with your credit card. Make sure to unsubscribe to your membership before the two months is over if you don't want to continue going on with that shit on to other topics man you can get an xbox one x today for 2.99 holy shit that's a good fucking deal i don't care who you are it's going to be supported for at least up to two more years or so we have heard but it looks like they're trying to get them out the door out the store they're trying to clear the warehouses Trying to get into next generation early. That's what I'm saying. Uh, rumors going around from a known source. A good insider for Xbox. Uh, apparently Xbox is going to drop some big news on Monday. And I sure hope so. I sure hope that comes to tuition. Because you know what's on Mondays. WBG, We Bleed Green Podcast, every Monday, 6.30 Pacific Time, 6 p.m., 6.30 p.m. Pacific Time, 5.30 Central. Be sure to check us out on Monday, and if that big news drops, baby, you know we're going to report on it. The best Xbox panelists in the game on YouTube right now today, in my opinion. 
Shit. So, on to other news. Bleeding Edge dropped an update today. Um, fixing things with matchmaking with parties. A lot of people couldn't get into games if they were in a party or cross play. You know, PC and Xbox having troubles with that. They fixed that. They fixed the achievement unlocks. The stability of the gameplay has been fixed, has been patched, and stuff with your Steam login and profile issues. That's been fixed. I don't play it on Steam, but if you do, well, they, they patched that apparently. So, hell yeah. More stable gameplay. That's what I like to hear. PC games coming, yeah, I already talked about Rust, I believe, Rust coming, uh, closed beta on Xbox, I'm gonna check that out, uh, Blizzard is adding gamepad support for World of Warcraft in Shadowlands, could be news of World of Warcraft coming to consoles in the near future, that, that would be dope, that game, that game might get a lot of flack, but it has a lot of it has a huge community and I'd be down to play it. We got dark shit games like Black Desert on console and it runs like shit. Bring on World of Warcraft. Fuck it. Let's do it. Um Vampire the Masquerade, Coteries of New York. Pre-order is live for Xbox One right now. We got 1971 Project Helios. It's coming to Xbox One on June 9th. So that's another PC game. If you, if you like PC games, but you don't like gaming on PC, wait for these games to come out on console. Uh, that, that about does it for me, man. I ain't got much shit to talk about. I just wanted to hop on here, do a quick video, say what's up to y'all, say my two cents. Hit the like button if you like the content. Subscribe, man. Check out WBG on Mondays. Scram Punks on Wednesdays, baby. Let's go. I'm Xbox. I'm bleeding green all day, every day. Never switch since day one. If you don't like the content, or if you're a pony, or you're a fucking Xbox hater, hit that dislike button. Still subscribe. Still share it out. Give me some love, bro. I appreciate all of you. I appreciate all of you. Have a good one, y'all.